Good evening everyone. Yep, it's that time again, Caravan Corner. Uh, I don't know if you can see, but we're actually in the night time now. And I have my onesie on. Yeah, <laughs> Keep me nice cozy. and cosy. Um, and that's it really. So on the, uh, the video today that's coming up, it's talking about us um, doing the second half of the scaffold and you'll see all the scaffold gone up full height now. Yeah, and, uh, which has been made, you put some safety rails, haven't you? So yeah. when I go up, yeah. well, we'll both be doing the work, yeah. won't we? But, but I made it safe so Tracy can feel safe when she goes comes up there. I'll be doing all the laying the, uh, stuff and bringing it up. But Tracy will come up now and then and just do some pointing and stuff like yeah. that. Um, but it's safe for her. Um, also, we just want to just want to talk quickly about the internet. Um, we we're trying to find the right time to post these videos up, and we can't we can't govern it because the video uh, the the internet here is so appalling. It's taking fifty five to sixty hours just to post up a half hour video. So we're we're just trying to find the right timing for all this, and uh, bear with us, and hopefully we'll get it right for you guys. Yep. Yep, and we're hoping, aren't we? Well, we've been told that maybe in the next year or so that we will be getting fibre optic. Fibre, hopefully. Yeah, so fingers crossed, the upload speed will be good as well as yeah. the internet speed. So. Also, we got some oak. Yes, we did. Which um, you um unloaded from the back of the trailer, trailer yeah, passed it up in, yeah. to me you'll see that in the video yeah you'll see me just stacking it all in different piles ready yep. and that's going to be um, used to make all the um, internal doors which will be yep. ledge and brace doors okay. with um what's the, the what so there'll be t yeah there'll be uh you'll, you'll have tng yeah. boarding on ledge and brace doors um no frames on them no and they're all in solid oak um and then we'll We'll put a nice light stain on them and, and oil them up or wax them, whatever. Um, and then I've got enough material there to make all the external shutters uh, to, for a thing here. It's, it's big in Normandy. Everything has external shutters on. Um, and there'll be some enough wood there to make the uh, front door and the back door. Yes. And also later on, not now, but I'm going to be doing green oak work where I'll be making a green oak porch. Uh, on a stone base um, and obviously what we talked about the Juliet uh, balcony yeah. around the back there yes we'll, we'll all be in all green oak work and I'll show you me doing that and that, uh, getting erected and everything um, also we had a wood burner yes we did we um, which mm -hmm. was a lot of controversy yeah. um, in that wasn't there really yeah we um, we we bought a, a wood burner back in May um, and it, it, we put it on, followed the instructions, uh, put a very light flame in there, let it come up slowly, uh, but it cracked. The top went bang, it literally went bang and cracked. So we felt it was a fault in the manufacturer's yep, castings, um, but we've had a long time getting this next one in, but we, we stuck with them, we was loyal to them because we had another one off them, a, a smaller one which you've seen already. Yeah. And, um, it you know, came, we, didn't it? Yeah, it came, it came. Anyway, it's here. So you'll see us and our mate just up the road. Adam. Adam, he's helping us bringing it in. I must admit, it, we actually got that in very quick. Yeah, I thought did. it might have taken a little bit lo longer, but we done well with uh, that, didn't we? Also, I've just done a little brief uh, sh sort of video, very, very quick, about our, my tractor we bought. Um, it's got, uh, it's an old Sammy, 1968. Um, and it's same uh, year as I was born. Same year she was born, yep. Yeah. And it, what it is is I've had, we've had to split it in half the tractor and take out the clutch system to put new clutch plates and thrust bearings and a few other things are going in it. Um, and so we got there's a lovely old fella Roy uh, comes from Cornish Pirate Land I call it. Yeah. Pirate. He talks <laughs> like a pirate. Arr. He looks anyway, like a pirate. He's a lovely old boy and he but he knows tractors inside out and uh, yeah, I'm I'm just his apprentice next to him. While he's telling me and showing me what to do, and that's about it, really. Yes, isn't it? It is. We got any more? No, I think that's about, isn't it? It's yeah. going to be a shorter video, definitely this um, week. This week, but then next week we will have quite a bit in our video because we'll have a trip um, to our local town because um, they're going to have a Christmas fair on. And the lights. And also, um, there's where we live, about five minutes down the road. Um, there's a massive um 
turning on of the lights where the church is so there'll yeah. be a lot of coach loads of people coming so Eglise, that'll be in Eglise, isn't it? Churches, yes churches yeah so uh, uh we'll we'll do some videos of, yeah be, be a bit, bit more of a video of where we are and uh what's going on in the local area yeah and that's it really yep, so uh, sorry if we sound a little bit slow tonight because we're uh Ooh. tired <laughs> knackered shattered and uh this is a uh, late at night now yeah. anyway guys we Chat to you all soon. Speak to you soon and enjoy the videos. Have a good evening. Bye. Bye bye. Hello, Chesie, come here. Chesie, say hello to the camera. Anyway, folks, this is part two of the scaffold. So I've put a safety rail all the way around, or Aris, uh, Aris fencing, we call it. Now we've gone up to the second level. Tracy's up the top. Bonjour, monsieur. Hello. I, um, I've built it in a way where I put lots of hand rails down the sides safety bars for tracy more than anything and i've sent her up there so she can get used to that and she's uh fine with the heights there's no wobble in the scaffold yeah um and also i've set up ladders over that end go up and then up this end hopefully it'll be safe enough for trace also i've put in this a frame to stop the scaffold moving i'll come around here so i've created an A-frame here which stops the scaffold wanting to move that way and fall over um, and there you go nice solid scaffold quick click system from the UK I've had it many many years it's never let me down always worked off this got plenty more of it as well sitting over there and inside uh, there you go that's it that's the finished scaffold we can now start working through the winter. Okay, folks, this is our uh, little wood stove burner we've just bought. Um, we've already had one of these, but it cracked. So we've now gone and got another one after six months of trials and tribulations. But it's uh, Alma Invicta, French make. Does put out lovely heat, about 12 kilowatts. Good bit of kit. Got our mate, Adam, who's our neighbor next door. Hello, Adam. Sure. He's come to help us today. And uh, we've got muscles here to give us this hand as well. Right, so <laughs> I'll put it on the uh, old tripod and we'll watch us struggle to bring this in. <laughs> centralize that up and then we'll uh, get the chimney all in and uh, get a cooking make the house warm anyway au revoir. okay folks this is our uh, new wood burner it's brand new it's uh, made by Invicta and it's called an Alma as a high rating it's a 12 kilowatt uh, wood burner it's not what we're used to in England, where we're used to them being lined with a um, a brick 
or stone that's uh, lined inside so it deflects the heat forwards but this one apparently has a casting that radiates the heat out from all the casting which is like the one we've got upstairs in the bedroom this is just a, the bigger version of that this is like the daddy version and uh it's looking good in its little spot i uh, lime plastered the back wall which was all granite but it was all cracked and horrible but it looks uh nice sitting there on that slate it's quite yeah i'm pleased with that anyway We're just um, unloading all the um, French oak, which we're going to be using for all our internal doors and external shutters. So we're just getting it off the trailer now and Budo's passing it up to me. And I'm just stacking it here. How's it going, Budo? Yep. Oh, it's heavy. Oh, it's <laughs> heavy, yep. Yeah, um, yeah this is all uh, French oak. Rough sawn. Yep. It's going to be all our um, internal doors. Yep. So I'm going to thickness and plane it all. Then I'll put a nice cock bead down the at one edge on the TNG. Yep. And they'll slot up. There'll be nice panel doors and oak. And we'll make them a nice rich, warm colour. Um, and all the furniture will be cast iron, black cast iron? Or black, or not cast iron, but yeah. uh, wrought iron. Of some Lovely, sort, yeah. yeah. And uh, it'll be all black furniture. So it'll give you that cottagey feel as well as a farmhouse, you know? Yeah, and suit the house perfect, won't it? But there's a lot of oak here. It's like nearly £3,000 worth. Wow. No, £3,000 worth. Yeah. Probably, so. That is a lot. Well, I better stop chatting and get that oak yeah, off get you. <laughs> so that's the trailer empty now. That's the second lot of oak we've had here. Um, this lot here we brought today, which I'm going to show you. I've been passing up, Tracy stacked it all in here. This is all for our house to do all the uh, doors, panel doors, the shutters on the external. This is all French oak. It's a lot of money's worth here, but it's, it's going to turn into beautiful, beautiful things. Sorry about the focus in there. I'm just having a rest. Yep, you having a rest. So Tracy's sitting over there. She's done really well. Passed all this up. She stacked it. it and uh, it smells so sweet. Anyone knows about oak and wood, they'll know that oak is such a lovely, sweet smell. Um, and this house has just gone lovely, isn't it, Tracy? It's just beautiful. Smelling I mean, you beautiful. see this in plank form. Yep. And what it's going to be made into, it's just... Well, that's it's it. Recycling, isn't yeah. it? Of a tree that's been taken down, and then it's going to be made into something yep. and live for quite a few hundred years. Well, it will do. It'll be a, it'll be a legacy here. What the um, the planks there that Tracy's sitting on? That's them and them at the front over there. They're um, they're all twenty seven mil, uh, random whips, roughly all about eight inches, six between six and eight inches, mostly towards eight. Um, and this stuff down here, this is all quartz sawn oak, uh, which is up to 50, no, sorry, 65 mil. So that makes nice framework and that. And we're having a problem with this focusing tray. Uh, yeah. And uh, me. they'll turn into lovely wood items for the house. Doors, shutters, and so front door, <laughs> back door, whatever. <coughs> Anyway, Stuff hope you enjoyed that. <laughs>
So we've got Roy here, stripping the tractor for me. We got, what clutch is it, Roy? Does it look good? It looks good, mate. What clutch is that? It's a, it's a, it's a little bit deaf, Roy. That's a double clutch. There we go. Is this a double clutch, Roy? Yeah, it's a live drive. Live yeah. drive, yeah, cool. Yeah. So, she's an old Sammy. It's a massive clutch. It's like a clutch on a 100 horsepower tractor. Aye. I'm this happy. The Joker's only 60. So, yeah. Yeah, she's a good old girl. She's strong. She's going to be lovely when we're done. Let's go around the back here. Let's look, built like a tank. Solid. She's broken in half at the moment, if you can see that. Lovely, and I'm here learning as well about my own tractor, so it's all good. There we 